love is a positive emotion that brings us closer and makes us compassionate about the object of our affection. And why does a piece of bad news connect us in masses more than love? Well, romantic love is one-on-one, -on -one, except in reverse harem situation. The general public gets stirred by a negative sentiment because we fear it could happen to us. It feels good to be in a better position than the suffering, and we skillfully mask it with a compassionate attitude. Let's set this ugly reality aside. Also, happy Valentine's Day. Love is often branded selfless. That totally and utterly baffles me. I mean, it is for someone other than you. So the separation has to occur. Yeah, I know, this is too abstract. Let me simplify. Another person catches your attention and you admire them. And then some time passes, making you realize you're in love. But since this motivation only comes after determining there is another, I call it separation. You see, self is your ego that makes you you. It is not a negative thing, but what establishes you as an individual. And if you genuinely go selfless with your feelings of love, you wouldn't even notice the person you love as they would be a part of you. Nevertheless, you want to feel it in return. And for that, the person you love has to be separate from you. So love, therefore, is division. Unfortunately, it stings if the feeling is too strong and not reciprocated because it is outside of you and your control. That's why love hurts. Regardless of the consequences, you must express your love to unburden the heaviness when you catch the feeling. This feeling takes a special place in your heart. You constantly confess or reiterate your love for validation. It hurts when you lose or never get it in return as it creates a void. It is scientifically proven that heartbreak destroys some muscles in your heart every time you experience it. Yep, heartbreak is real, people. There are many annotations of love, but my take is deathly unromantic. To me, selfless love is unspoken and unexpressed. If something is a part of you, you wouldn't focus on physical material presence. And that is simply impossible in our world. So go on, fall in love, enjoy the division, decadence, separated animalism, or spiritual connection. Here are quotes from my book about love. Love is just like the concept of God, open to many interpretations. Delphian, I want us to exist together until we perish. Pure. You don't love him, but love the idea of loving him. That unique charm of forbidden love entices you. It is the same with every human being. They love life overly, knowing well death is the only truth. How did you make love to a repulsive being like me? How can you confess so freely when I have turned ugly? This is the only time I can say that I love you. The love that I have for you is notwithstanding your outer splendor. Unconditional. Are you blind? Nope. My vision is the clearest at the moment.